Hello everybody, today I'm in London and to be more precise I'm in Canary Wharf which is a very business oriented area there are lots of skyscrapers, lots of glass and structures it is very nice I'm shooting with a Rollei 35S it's a film camera from 90 1970 something which I bought on eBay it's very good for street photography as well as you can basically retract the lens tuck the lens inside and then bring it out and it really really tiny look at that so I loaded it with some Portra 400 um, which is not the best like daylight average film it's more of a maybe sunset oriented film and landscape oriented film I really wanted to give it a try in these conditions and there are quite a few interesting colors which I think can be rendered quite good by this film and on this camera it's pretty weird because the dials are on the front and the light meter is on the top so it is really intended to be used as a chest camera or something like that but you basically need to turn these dials and make this tiny white line go into the circle into the other end circle in order to have a proper exposure and right now we are already at, at f22 1500 which is the limit of this camera because the film is at 400 iso so it's pretty good for low life situation and that's not the case another interesting fact is that the focus is here on the lens but you don't really get a feedback when you look through the view the viewfinder so you have to kind of guess the distance from your subject frame it and then just wait for the right moment uh, i can see uh, this is still a very nice frame it was an Aston Martin, very nice car and we just need a subject to interact with it it would be nice to have contrasting colors like something red Four steps back once again the exposure reading is quite good so we can just wait for a subject to come by There we go. It's very, very tiny. No one's gonna really notice that you're taking photos. And even if they do, it looks very, very, um, I just say, it looks like a toy. So I think this is a very nice way to be unnoticed. Look yeah, at those cool stripes on the ground. The reading is pretty good. Um, I might have a vertical conversation here with the palace in the background. There we go. have another image here. Um, there you go. See how this turns out in a few weeks I guess. I don't actually develop my own film but I have this very nice film shop that I just can so I'm gonna get those digital files and I can save them for later on. I have been working great so far, so I just think we're gonna keep going like this. Uh, I got to say, coming from South Wall, it's pretty insane to walk around in those huge concrete glass and steel 
buildings because I'm definitely not used to it not anymore at least yeah I really like the geometry that you find here F11 one one twenty fifth second okay, any good photo and there we go I guess this so this was on point So the shutter counter is also on the bottom because they really didn't have all the room to develop this camera so uh, it's right here we're actually at 18 or yeah 18 the next one will be the 19th I shot this a few a few times in this trip some of the light but yeah the color look absolutely great looks absolutely great um, four There we go. Well, this can also be quite interesting, I think. Um, if you go like this. I hope it was in focus anyway. Up. Wait, what? This is cool. Let's go to a fate. Okay, so. Quite difficult to expose. Probably, but wow. This is a very nice leading line. Um, love it. Might go a little bit back here and, and try to get the little line and everything yeah this looks absolutely stunning oh my oh, from here it's gonna look even better yeah we just need the subject here really to have 12 photos very good wow look at that there is some very such light here definitely nice I can also hear some birds
Yeah. Will work. Maybe or six. Yeah. Behind me, sorry for that. Wow, that looks absolutely great. Nice composition. And I only have a few shots left, a few frames left. Um, it's incredible because it was raining like. Was chucking it down incredibly hard, and then after like two minutes, it completely opened up. Like we can see blue skies now. to the starting point which was around there sorry for the wind noise um it was a very nice walk very long walk as well yeah look at that um i'm still gonna do a couple of photos before i actually switch to digital and yeah move on has been a superb day with rain sun and everything in between still not sure where the portrait is the best film for this kind of thing the my Overexpose it a bit. Yeah. We're all pretty happy about the day. So it's time to get the film out and rewind it. So let's do it here. Disengage that, open this, and we start retrieving it. Yeah, it's going. Okay. Great. Let's bring it out. Yeah, perfect. There's some bits and pieces that are not great. I don't know if I got it too straight out at the end, but I think it's fine. There's nothing around, so yeah. I'll put it in there again. And I will change film tonight. We're gonna shoot some some nice not photography as well as always if you like this video please consider subscribing and tell me in the comment which photo of this photo shoot was actually your favorite so until next time ciao